Yeah. Now you also, in interviews, I've noticed that you talk about your serious writing, your serious songs that you're very proud of. And I was saying those songs from Innisbook of World Records, but in this book of records, do have a kind of wistful touch. You do write serious stuff in addition. They're not all parody songs no, or they're not. homages. No, you know? I mean, because I, I don't see why. You know, I mean, Shakespeare was allowed to do drama as mm. well as comedy. Right. So, I mean, I think the human experience is both, you know, a certain amount of suffering and a certain amount of joy. Mm. And, and, and so why should, you know, someone be a permanent sort of, ho, 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 ha, ha. <laughs> That's madness, sure, right. you know. There's that wonderful story about a man who's really depressed who goes to the doctors oh. and said, I'm so, you know, I really, you know, I feel I want to end it all. He said, no, 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 you shouldn't feel like that. Why don't, the great Pagliacci is right. in town. Why don't you <laughs> go and see him? I am the great Pagliacci. <laughs> right, right. So, I mean, the, the, the constant grinning and buffoonery is madness, you know. Oh. And equally, you know, being a, you know, doom merchant mm. is all also, you know. You know yeah. So, I mean, I try and strike a balance, you know, the more thoughtful things and the more fun things. You know, I like a good giggle, and I also care about things. And mm. I like to think about things and, 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 and ponder them and, and come up with solutions. I, th I think the, the song Friends at the End of the Line mm. is, is half decent. You know, I've worked very hard on that to get that right. And kind of knew what I, I didn't want it to be so, I didn't want it to be sort of maudlin. And and what yeah. album is that on? I'm not familiar uh, with that. Uh, that's uh, that? I think a works in progress. Ah, okay. Uh, I can get you a copy of that. Oh, okay. Um, but there's a d and that was under the radar because basically, I decided you know that I wasn't going to be high profile. Mm. I've done that before when I was doing children's television. I just go under the radar, mm. and I'm busy. I'm happy. I'm doing things, and 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 the same with you know this. Only this time it was to get out of being published by you know global robber barons <laughs> so it's worked and i've got all my publishing back now oh great oh it's terrific from january today so right. no longer am i just neil innes <laughs> ego warrior and style guru <laughs> i'm now neil innes ego warrior style guru and fame slut ah <laughs>